All right, YouTube. All right, Raider Nation. This is your boy, LB. And I'm back once again with another video. I know y'all wondering why I'm so happy. I know y'all wondering why I'm sound excited or why I'm smiling. But I'm about to speak on Thursday night game between the Oakland Raiders and San Francisco 49ers. So, I gave y'all my prediction. I gave y'all my preview. I gave y'all my thoughts of ball. What could happen? So, basically, I wanted Oakland to win, but I had doubts that they could lose. So, I'm not going to throw no rant. I'm not going to pretend to be angry. I'm not even going to damn anyone. I'm not even going to talk down on anyone. Because this nothing unexpected. Oakland been playing bad football all season. Come on now. What's there to be mad about? What's there to be angry about? Oakland has been playing bad football all season. So, this game was nothing new. I, I turned from the game first quarter. It's like you want your team to play good, and you don't want them to play bad at the same time. But <coughs> people have to understand what's about to happen, what's going on. It's like we have a new coach. There's a new system. He he is trying to build his own team because every time he take over a team, it's like people discredit him by saying this was the previous coach team. This was the previous coach team. He won with the previous the previous coach team. He won with that coach team. Like let this man build his own team. Like come on now. Let this man build his own team. It's just like, let's say if he would have kept everybody, Marquette King, Crabtree, uh, Sebastian Janikowski, uh, who else? Amari Cooper, Cleo Mack, Derek Hall. Let's say he, if he did keep everybody, let, let's say he did keep everybody. If he would have kept everybody, we know we wouldn't want to the playoffs. That's a, that's a playoff team. We were going to playoffs. We was going to playoffs if you would have kept everybody. That's guaranteed. We all know that. Now, let's say if he won the Super Bowl with that team, what would people would have said? He won with Jack Dare Rio and Reggie McKenzie team. That's what people would have said. He won with Reggie McKenzie and Jack Dare Rio team. That's what people would have said. That's fast. That is fast. That's what people just said. So, stop trying to talk down with John Gruden. This man has been coached in 10 years. Y'all expect this man to come in one year and change everything. How many of y'all can go build y'all own team? No, no, no. Matter of fact, how many of y'all can go coach a team in one year? Go coach Already go coach a bad team and take it to the Super Bowl. Let me know. Because I coach. I coach basketball and football. So y'all let me know. How many of y'all can go take over a bad team and go win a Super Bowl in one year? After for being for not coaching 10 years. How many of y'all can do it? Y'all can't. Because I'm not going to coach somebody else's bad team and try to Build that team to go into Super Bowl. No, I'm going to build my own team because I have my own style of coaching. I have my own scheme. I have my own system. So I want my own team. So I'm going to rebuild my own team. So that's what John Gordon had to do. He's trying to build his own team. So let this man build his own team. You cannot build your own team your first year back. No, it takes years and years and years to build your own team. Just like the Cleveland Browns. The Cleveland Browns in the past three years had over 35 drop picks. 35 drop picks. Come on now. But 
this San Francisco game wasn't a shock to me. I had shit. I kind of figured Oakland was going to lose. But to get beat by third string, that's what people are actually mad about. I understand y'all mad about that, but shit. Y'all, like, the season over with already. I'm looking for the drive. But I understand how y'all feel about Oakland losing to a third string. But it ain't no reason to throw rants and be angry, angry. It, like, it's like, it ain't that serious. Like, okay. Oakland, defense horrible. Oakland, offense is playing bad. So, if y'all knew this, why y'all so angry? Y'all should have back in y'all mind that Oakland, Oakland could lose this game. Because they not playing like they want. They not playing like they were going to the Super Bowl. They already know this ain't the team that can take them to the Super Bowl. They don't have the players to take them to the Super Bowl. They don't have the players that can compete in the playoffs. They don't have the team they need to compete. They don't, they don't have the team and player that they need to win a lot of games consistently. They just don't have the players on the team right now. So you got to be patient. So that's how I feel about the 49 game. Like, I'm not mad. I'm not upset. Because I'm going to trust the process. So <clears throat> it was a lot of horrible plays on defense, a lot of bad plays on offense. So, I'm not going to say John Gruden or coach. I'm going to say they are there tanking. That's what I'm going to say. They are there tanking, for real. This is like full rebuild mode. This is rebuild mode at its best. This is rebuild mode at its best. So, the Oakland, yes, Oakland look awful right now. Oakland look awful. Horrible. Oh, rebuild mode at its best. But the 49ers, though, the 49ers. I know it's a battle debate. But what are y'all battling for? Come on now, what are you battling for? Like, who cares? I know Raiders fans want to talk shit to the 49ers, fan, but you know your team playing bad. You know this team can't compete. You know this not the team that you want to see on the field. This definitely not a season I want to see on the field. Hell no. Nah. This is not a team I, I want to see on the field. I want to see a new and approved Raiders team. And John Gruden can actually build this team off the draft. Y'all just have to go look at the net draft class. I've been saying this ever since week five. You have to go look at the net draft class. If you know college football, you know what the next you know what the next draft class look like. Twelve of the top pass rushing nation is in the draft. If you can't get three pass rushers, if you can't get Nick Bosa, what's up the guy name? It's like Casealing, no, not Casealing, Ceiling Ferrell, something like that. He he played for Clemson. He a defensive tackle and the defensive end Austin Bryant for uh, Clemson. Oakland get Nick Bosa, Cecilin Farrell, and Austin Bryant out the draft. Get them two out the draft. That's who you need to get out the draft. Them three pass rush. First round. That defense line will look nice. PJ Hall. No, no, no. Nick Bosa. PJ Hall. Mo Hurst. Uh Cecilin Farrell and Arden Key. All young guys on the defensive line. That defensive line will look nice with them. Cause Bruce Irvin, I ain't gonna get on him yet. I'm gonna get on him in another video. But them guys right there, they actually bring this Oakland Raiders defensive line back to life. Cause give give um, Mo Hurst some time. I believe Mo Hurst can be another Warren stop. But I'm not upset about the game. Yeah, Oakland got blown off. I'm not gonna rant. I'm not gonna go crazy. Cause it, I'm gonna 
save my energy. I'm, I'm waiting for the drop. I really don't care about that photo announcement. Because we're not going nowhere. This Y'all know this team not going nowhere. You know this team cannot go compete in the playoff or the Super Bowl. Y'all know this. So why be mad? Just get ready for the NFL draft. That's all I'm saying. But all right, y'all. I'm out. Peace.